Welcome to Cat School. In today's cat training lesson, you are going to learn how to brush your cat's teeth. Brushing your cat's teeth is the gold standard for helping your cat have a healthy mouth. With positive training methods, treatments like nails and teeth brushing can be an enjoyable experience for your cat. It's a good idea to check in with your vet first to make sure your cat doesn't need a professional cleaning before you start brushing their teeth. In this first step, we are gonna teach your cat to love the toothbrush. All I do here is I put something tasty on the toothbrush and I let the cat lick it off. Jones loves this lickable treat, so I try to reserve it for the harder lessons, like this one. Putting your cat's favorite treat on the toothbrush is a great way to introduce them to this new tool. In this step, we're gonna help your cat respond positively to being touched. We're gonna start with the easy zones, like your cat's back, but the goal is to move up to their head and chin area where you're gonna to need to hold your cat when you brush their teeth. Here I am touching Jones first and then I give him a piece of food. I keep doing this over and over again in all these zones until I can work up to the chin and head area. The goal is not to touch your cat when they are distracted, but instead to wait until your cat is attentive and then show them that touch leads to delicious food. If your cat moves around a lot, consider using a platform to help with this exercise. If you have a cat that is really excited about food, you can lower the value of food or supplement these exercises with clicker training to teach them some self-control. Because we're gonna need to be holding our cat's head, we have to make sure that they're comfortable having their face touched and their neck and under their chin. Spend lots of time touching your cat in these zones and then presenting them with their favorite food. If you take the time to do this work, your cat can learn to enjoy being handled and touched around their face. Now we're gonna focus on teaching your cat a chin rest. This is an important step in the training because it teaches your cat a signal for them to say, I'm ready to move forward with brushing. I guide the cat's head up with a piece of food and then place my hand under their chin. As soon as they lower their head into position, I say yes and then feed them up high to start another repetition. Normally, I would use a clicker to teach this, but for teeth brushing, both our hands are needed. So I'm substituting the click with the word yes. Yes tells the cat they did it correctly and a treat is coming. If you haven't taught this yet, you're gonna wanna back up a step and work on that first. Yes. <gasps> yes. Good job. Good job. Now the cat should be comfortable resting their chin on your hand and we're going to turn it into more of a hold. The hold is necessary for brushing teeth. Notice how I'm turning my hand from the, under his chin to more around the side of his head towards the back. Practice with both hands, not only for your cat but also for you. You're going to need to get good at holding the cat's head with each of your hands so that you can brush both sides of their mouth. Raise your thing up. Yes! Lickable treats can do a great job helping your cat yes. hold these positions for longer periods of time. Uh. Yes! In this step, I'm getting rid of having to draw his head up. I'm simply yes. presenting my hand and then as soon as he puts his head into position, I reward yes. him. Present the hand. Yes. 
you should see your cat respond to your hand. So when you present your hand, they put their head into the correct position. Yes. And? Yes. Good. And I'm going to throw in a bit more yes. duration now, just making Good. sure he can hold it into this position. One, two, Increasing the length of time yes. that he's okay with his head in that position Great. is going to help with the teeth brushing down the road. When you brush your cat's teeth, you're going to be holding their head with one hand and using the other hand to brush. So now we're going to get him used to two hands. One hand to hold his head and the other hand is going to touch his face. When starting a new step, try to make it easy at first. That's why I'm touching his back area. Then I can work towards the head zone. After each repetition, he gets a break to eat the treat that he loves. And here I'm focusing on the face zone, making sure that he's comfortable with me touching around his mouth. Using your finger is a great way to start introducing touch inside your cat's mouth without having to have the awkwardness of holding yes. a toothbrush. I gently hold his head Yes. Then I place my finger inside his mouth and touch his teeth, and then I present him with his treat. The chin rest is a guide that your cat is ready for further treatments. If they back away, give them a break, and then try again yes. later. I really like working yes. with a Q-tip as a step before the toothbrush because of its size, a lot easier than the toothbrush. So it's, it's also really good practice of getting you yes. used to putting the object in your cat's mouth while you hold their head. A tooth wipe is also a good option for this step. You can wrap it around your finger and start working good. on getting inside your cat's mouth. I spent a lot of time at this step, just getting comfortable touching inside his mouth and figuring out the best way for me to hold his head so that I could effectively brush his teeth. In this step, we reintroduce the brush. I don't put anything on the brush for this step because I just want to focus on making sure he's okay accepting the brush in his mouth. Short sessions are key and you can always build on the amount of time that your cat accepts these treatments. If your cat maintains a sit position during these procedures, that's a good sign. If they're standing and always ready to walk away, that's probably telling you you're going a little bit too fast. Yes. There are a variety of pet-friendly toothpaste on the market. It's important to find something that your cat likes, otherwise it's going to make this process a lot more challenging. Check out the benefits of coconut oil to decide if it's Good. the right option for your cat too. Good. Nice. We are now at the finish line and putting all the steps together. With the coconut oil on the toothbrush, I'm gently holding his head and brushing his teeth. Brushing your cat's teeth is a journey. These steps can take a long time. Yes. Practice these steps consistently, and I'm sure you'll be able to get to the finish line. Yeah. Thanks for watching, and I wish you lots of success brushing <laughs> your cat's teeth. Yeah.